is up YouTube, Joe Woe here, and I played Warzone 1 again in 2023, and is this the reason that Warzone 2 is dying? Let's get into it. All right, we're back on the Warzone 1 Caldera, which in case you guys don't know, I see a lot of comments on some of the other videos I, I, I posted in Warzone 1. If you have Modern Warfare 2019, you can actually play this game again, and every time I've played, lobbies fill up instantly, and I think that kind of goes back to maybe people were leaving Warzone 2 to go back and play Warzone 1 again. And it blows my mind because, like I said, every time I play, the lobbies fill up instantly and you get a game in quads or solos very, very fast. You can open up Modern Warfare 2019 and actually just go down to Warzone Caldera and still play this game anytime you want. So in today's video, I'm going to be playing some solo quads and basically I'm just going to be kind of talking through the game, what I think of Warzone 2 right now and hope you guys enjoy it. Like I said, I've done the, the past Warzone 1 videos and you guys really, really enjoy watching me play this game again and I enjoy playing it. So obviously I'm not going anywhere for Warzone 2. We'll still have our normal gameplays, nuke series, coaching, all that kind of stuff. But if you guys would like to see maybe like a weekly, I don't know, Warzone 1 gameplay or something, let me know down below. Let me know also your guys' feedback of what you guys think of the current state of Warzone 2. And have you guys played this game again? And let's get into it. I mean, we got to go peek. Uh, it, it, it's only right. Wait. I miss being able to shoot out of the sky. Oh my gosh. I forgot about that. I totally forgot that you could shoot people out of the sky. Because right now, once again, I don't really understand at all. Um, Warzone 2 gives people spawn protection. Like when they're flying back in from the gulag, you actually get spawn protection. And I feel like... I feel like that shouldn't be a thing. I guess it should be a thing in like resurgence, but normal BR spawn protection is kind of weird to me. See what's going on here. Being able to shoot flying in, like already, already, I can tell so much. So many things in this game just feel fluid. The movement, the just everything that you're doing just feels very, very. Oh my gosh. This feels so normal and fluid. In Warzone 2, I feel like when you're playing, everything is like a step-by-step -step process. Like you gotta mantle something twice. You gotta pistol out while you're trying to mantle a wall. Like, I don't know. Let's see where this loadout's about to drop. I may even have enough. Oh, literally right here, nice. The lootable perks. I'm gonna also buy a quick UAV. Being able to use a buy, a quick buy, again, going back to the step by step process. There's no like looking at gear, being able to buy gear. Every buy station changes what they have. Normal Warzone 1 buys. So you go into the buy, you can buy as many things as you want. Everything stays the same. Like, even it's simple. I, I really like that about, about this game, especially. Let's bring out the growl in 2023 and see how it's feeling. Wait. This heli just took off so fast. What the heck? I forgot how fast these cars take. Oh, that's sir. Got him. What? I was about to say, these hobbies are going to be either... Wait, how did the heli survive? Oh, chill. About to be really sweaty or really body, and so far... They are looking a little bit body. And I'm not mad at it at all. Tired of Warzone 2 skill-based matchmaking. Hmm. This who shot me right here? Being able to land like alleys, vehicles, all that so easy, like holy cow.
Oh my gosh, the movement. The movement skill gap. I miss it so much, man. Basically, the only vehicle also that is anywhere semi-good in Warzone 2 is like the Hummer. But I feel like the only reason why it's semi-good is because Hummer paid Call of Duty to have their vehicle in the game. So like they, they super buffed it to make that the only good one. It's like helicopters and everything else just they're all very uh low you know see what we got going on down here you know this guy was getting shot in the back there Shooting. Was he trying to shoot my car from across the map? Sir. I'm about to land on him. Being able to shoot off of zips too is so nice. Oh, actually, he's about to get landed on right now. Wow. Oh my gosh. The movement! The movement! I miss the movement skill gap so much. You don't realize how much of a skill gap it is. I mean, obviously, being able to press circle circle x 50,000 times over is very annoying but being able to out finesse a team is just Oh my gosh. It all happens so fast. So being able to out finesse a team oh, with movement feels so good again. We got like plating and running now, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about that. About that being a movement. I mean, it's, I guess it's movement, but like nothing like this. All right, I think I'm gonna head uh, downtown real quick and just guarantee me a quick loady again. I have 15 with 60, that's actually not bad. Ooh, the portable redeploys. The thing I really do hope that they kind of bring back to is the buy stations. The portable buy stations were really good. Because now I, I don't know. There's like not a lot of buys for Warzone 2. And on top of that, half the time, I you can't even buy half the stuff that you're trying to buy. So I'm like, oh, I forgot about these chests actually. But yeah, like half the times, like you can't even buy the things that you're trying to buy. I feel like there's definitely a team here. Did a board token? No, but it did drop us the bag though. Uh, I didn't really want to use this right here, but it's fine. Sounds like there's somebody shooting like right above me somewhere. There is. If this kind of still a one shot kill. Hey man, how's your face? Oh, it's completely off your body. That's cool. Well, they we see they didn't fix the Gorenko. I'm gonna buy a quick loadout. Loadout drop. Buy a UAV. Love it. I love how like you can buy multiple of those. It's so nice. I'm gonna grab tempered too. Wait, this is not what I want. Wait, did I not grab the automaton class? Okay, well, I guess I'm rocking a Gringo. Enemy UAV. Enemy UAV active. UAV is out of 
Hey, with me, guys. I forget the layout of these buildings so much. There you go. Ow. Oh. This there advanced? Downtown. Oh my gosh. This may be the spot to be. He said I'm handsome, not confirmed though. And everything in it feels so fluid in this game. I'm definitely hearing a lot of Gorinko, which is kind of terrifying because I know how how much that class haunted this game. Ooh, the big game bounty for the advanced UAV. So many little things I feel like we should have right now. Like, my thoughts on it, it's like, if something isn't broke, like, why fix it, you know? Like, why do we not have these now? Why do... Why can't we buy multiple things from a buy station? Like, so many things like that. I'm like, it was never really broke, so... Why are we fixing it, you know? I don't know. Looking like he ain't moving. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just zip in front of them and hold them. The little zip up front here. I got a feeling they're probably not moving in this building. Enemy soldier nearby. In the back, hello? I so cannot see that person. Hello, <laughs> reload real quick. Thank you, sir, for that durable. I really needed that. I also don't really want to use this uh, sniper because I am choking shots bad. There's so many people. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Do you guys miss a movement skill gap or is it just me? I, I, I don't know. I, maybe it's just me. Yeah, about, uh, about me sniping. Uh, yeah. Please. Please, game. Gas 
is closing in. I've got to be top two and not two worst snipers ever. Oh. I can tell that this squad right here is passionate. Also, the time to kill pros were really, really good too. Hmm. I wonder if they try to like flank me. Well, they could have tried to hold me too. I feel like that's probably their best play. We'll see how smart and coordinated of a team they are. Okay, I could be going blind too, but I swear that this game looks like more blurry or something. I think I'm crazy though. I'm curious how many. Are they pushing down or oh, what's good boys? Oh my gosh. One V two V one. Can I get I can't drop a thirty though. Yo guys, be honest. What if I did like a weekly upload oh on Wars on One? God fuck. Get me out. This may be the most fun I've had in weeks. He's gotta be over here. Hey, he's rezzing. Sure, rez again, please. Okay, wait, actually, wait, one before. Oh my gosh. Peace. Oh, yo, I'm cheating. No! No! Guys, let me know down below. What is your biggest differences that you see between this game and Warzone 2? And let me know what you guys like to watch better. Because I've been seeing a lot of comments. Every time I play this game on Twitch, everybody's like, play this more, play this more, play this more. Please, Joe, this game's amazing. This game is fun, man. I miss a skill gap so much.